P.S. Eliot once wrote, April is the cruelest month, but I'm pretty sure he wasn't talking about Vuda. But if there's one thing that I do know, it's that making a video every weekday for a month is hard. It's the last day of Vuda, and boy am I glad. But Rebecca, you didn't upload a video yesterday. You failed Vuda. Wrong. I failed Vuda when I didn't upload a video last Friday, and no one noticed. Or at least no one cared enough to mention it. But I'm okay with that. For what it's worth, I did try to make a video yesterday. I tried to do a song, but I kept messing up and I got really frustrated. My hair is my room. So then I decided to hang out with my friends instead. But Vuda has taught me a few things. I learned that forcing yourself to make stuff on a schedule can be both a good and a bad thing. On one hand, not every video I posted this month was my best. But on the other hand, forcing myself to make videos every day got me out of the idea slump I was experiencing, and I made some stuff that I liked. I got over my fear of people hearing me sing. I learned that there are valid reasons for holding your fork upside down. Thanks, Steve. And I got one marriage proposal and one forehead compliment. All in all, I'd say Vuda was a very worthwhile project. And now I'm never going to make a video ever again. Just kidding, I'm doing vlog every day in May. Just kidding, I'm gonna go back to making videos whenever I feel like it.